This is Irene Jabbers at the Museum Edge, reporting for State of the Arts, New York City edition. There is an important historical exhibit at New York University's Gray Art Gallery on the work of the German artist Fritz Asher. This retrospective pulls together the work of this far too long overlooked and important expressionist artist. Asher is one of the many artists who have been characterized as part of a lost generation of creatives whose lives and careers were cut short by Nazi censorship and or persecution and death in labor and concentration camps. In 1933, when Hitler and his Nazi minions came to power, Although Asher had been baptized as Protestant, the Nazi racial laws classified him as Jewish. As a result, he could no longer make, show, or sell his artwork. He went into hiding, and in 1938, during the savage night known as Kristallnacht, Asher was arrested and sent to Sachsenhausen concentration camp, and then he was sent to Potsdam prison. After he was released, and then in 1942, he was warned that all Berlin Jews were to be deported to concentration camps, and he went into hiding. Unable to paint, he turned to poetry and writing until the end of the war. After 1945, he continued living in Berlin and returned to painting, but stayed clear of any social and political involvement. He stopped painting figuratively and turned to landscape painting inspired by the Grunewald forest that was near his home. His expressionist style reasserted itself with his bold brushstrokes, splashes of paint, and intensity of colors. In his heyday, pre- and post-World War I, his expressionist works reflected many spiritual, mythic, and operatic themes. The exhibition includes many of these works, including his painting and sketches of Christ's Passion. Another recurring theme is the golem from Jewish folklore, a mythical creature that is constructed from mud and brought to life by the rabbi Judah Lowe from Prague to protect the Jewish community from persecution. The exhibit also has several of Asher's paintings that depict Bozazu, the clown, from the opera Pagliacci by Leon Cavallo, as a tragic and isolated figure. During the 1920s, Asher used his bold brush and jarring colors to paint more and more violent and nightmarish scenes of hellish torture, including the painting of the temptation of Saint Anthony. For this viewer, his self-portrait of 1953 with its darkened strokes and haunted eyes conveys to me the sufferings of this deeply sensitive and under-recognized artist who made art at a time of terrible darkness and destruction. This exhibit is a celebration of the making of art in the midst of devastation, a tribute to creativity. The exhibit Fritz Asher Expressionist runs through April 6, 2019 at New York University's Gray Art Gallery at 100 Washington Square East, Manhattan, New York City. This is Irene Jabbers at the Museum Edge for State of the Arts, New York City edition.